hello viewers so today we have the fresh tutorial uh, for a uh, knockout js so we are uh, introducing a new tutorial in our channel with the uh, knockout js so uh, you commonly know about uh, mvvm a uh, pattern mvvm pattern is nothing but model view and view model pattern so a lot of uh, web UI is now uh, good enough to build with the uh, mevm with dot net mvc structure so that is what today we are here to experience with the uh, knockout js so uh, today we will just go and get started with the uh, knockout js with very basic uh, stuffs okay so this is a uh, helps us to build a model view view model uh, pattern and here uh, you're going to learn how to define the UI's appearance using the views and declarative bindings and its uh, data and behavior using a view model and observable and here uh, everything stays in a synchronous automatically okay so uh, totally it is like uh, see suppose I have a field uh, uh, something like a uh, some text box uh, that I am displaying my uh, first name like go freelancer suppose my model uh, if I am updating my model or uh, it will be uh, triggered my model uh, or uh, my data is get updated in the database automatically it will synchronize my model and it will change to the UI so that is what the speciality of a knockout JS have so here we go uh, I just go and uh, flip my Visual Studio. So, okay, I, j I just remove some unwanted contents. Okay, so here I have a div with a first name and a last name. Go free a uh, launcher. So this is a static uh, content that I'm having in my page. Now I just want to bind this record of from the function of uh, knockout.js so today is uh, we're going to see the first tutorial of uh, knockout.js so this is my uh, knockout uh, library uh, the current version is 3.30 and I going to write my function now script type equal to text.javascript here you can uh, declare some function function something like app model okay and uh, this dot uh, first name okay go freelance go star let me keep a star here and this dot last name freelancers okay stop okay nice so uh, my uh, first name and last name is holding uh, in this function so here I go and uh, enable co dot apply my bindings so I'm going to declare and apply bindings new instance of uh, this uh, model okay and okay I will ask uh, to apply my bindings and here we go and data bind text text first name because I want to the bind the text so likewise copy paste same okay here and I just going to remove this content remove it and this must be a last name 
oops only this particular okay so fine uh, so everything uh, is ready I uh, take uh, my library and uh, I made one function called app model in that two variables holdings uh, go free launcher text so I am declaring the new binding so okay go on to refresh the page yeah so now uh, my data is uh, binding from the knockout js so if you refresh page you will get to know about that so go star freelancer star that i am binded from the function app model so uh, this is the way uh, to make the initial uh, load to apply uh, uh, to the ui or uh, to the doom elements so in a future session we're going to see a uh, lot of interesting stops with using the knockout and feel the experience of knockout js so stay tuned our channel by subscribe if you are not subscribed please subscribe our channel thanks for watching the video guys if you have any doubt queries related with this tutorial please uh, share your comments